in the big cities you have MRI scans, CT scans and all the big things, many drugs, but as soon as you go 10 kilometers out of town, no technology what at all, whatsoever. And so we want to uh, be that company that's able to develop and commercialize technologies for the bottom of the pyramid in the health space. If you're an environmentalist, you should be appalled, obviously, by virtue of paper. If you are an operations guy, you'll be very appalled because of the inefficiencies. But if you also believe in the sanctity of life, you would say, I have to do something about it and be angry. And angry I was. And that led to the development of Ziti, which is an enterprise application. The uh, challenges are at a couple of levels. One, they are structural challenges because a lot of the issues at the bottom of the pyramid are issues because of structural barriers. They are financial barriers and they are barriers of people needing to believe in solutions that work for the bottom of the pyramid. Is that ZD now has a proprietary protocol which is called a crowd optimization protocol where any physician who has seen a meningitis case anywhere in the world, their symptoms would feed into the pool such that the next time the nurse sees something like that, if you put soft head, it would prompt her and say potential meningitis, look for other signs and that baby's life will be saved. So ZD is now an enterprise system built with a proprietary algorithm for crowd optimization and that's saving lives. It has allowed us to be very visible with all the people that have visited the, um, the website. We've had the opportunity now to have a first invest investor uh, facing conversations with people interested in impact investment in the health sector. And so that's very good for us. It has also allowed us to really think a little bit more clearly about our business model, especially the business model for the private sector.